Do you know more than 300,000 Indian students fly abroad for education every year? Do you know almost 100,000 of them fly to Europe? Europe is a continent full of 50 countries. Now, of course, you don't want to study anywhere. So how do you choose? You choose the dynamic economies. You choose countries where education is quite good. Most of the international students choose those destinations. You choose those countries for education system, their universities, rankings, reputation, and most importantly, cost. Cost becomes a huge factor when a middle-class Indian student flies abroad for higher education thinking of an international career. And with the rising middle class, of course, more and more Indian students would be flying abroad. Some 10 years ago, less than 50,000 Indian students were going abroad for education. Earlier, education abroad was only for the elites and it was a status symbol. Not today. Because of low cost, because of higher uh, rankings, ranked, higher ranked universities in Europe, because of education and information, because of internet, today we are connected to the world. So we're not just limited to a local territory, but we are open and able to study anywhere that we want to. Now, if you look at Europe, there are lots of countries, lots of destinations, but if you look at France and Germany and UK, these are some of the finest destinations for Indian students where they can go and study. Not just because these are dynamic economies or educational rankings, but the cost is quite less compared to America or Canada or Australia. I'm not saying these are not good destinations. I'm just saying these ones are quite cost effective. Now, if you want to study fashion, where would you want to go? If you want to study business, where would you want to go? If you want to study engineering or technology or research, where would you want to go? My job is to tell you the subjects, the interests and uh, the opportunities that you have. Your job is to choose the right school for yourself. I cannot tell you or no consultant in the world can tell you which school to go to. What is the right program for you? Everybody's job is to help you and let you choose the right program for yourself. So you choose the program. You want to become an engineer. You want to become an analyst you want to become a finan uh, finance expert you want to be in investment banking you want to be a pro digital marketer choose the career that you want to have and then visit somebody who can help you i would be very happy to assist you if you want to study in france especially at catch business school where i am right now catch business school is one of the largest or should i say the largest independent business school in france with 10 campuses globally Kedge Business School is the only campus which has only business school that has its campus on Mediterranean and Atlantic coast. It is one of the 1% or should I say less than 1% of the business schools globally. How many business schools are there globally? 13,000 plus. How many of them have triple accreditation? Less than 95. Kedge Business School is one of them. Do you know that all of the Kedge programs, masters and bachelors rank among top 10, not just in France, but top 100 globally? You look at digital marketing, you look at marketing, traditional marketing, international business, you look at design school, you look at bachelor's programs, supply chain, purchasing and innovation. These are some of the programs which are not available in India. So I'm not saying Indian schools are not good or that school is not good or that country is not good. But here you have more opportunities. There are two kinds of students, one who go for MBA in operations and others who go for a specialized education and purchasing and innovation or logistics or maritime or shipping or supply chain but what are they they are in a way family of each of these subjects so my only suggestion to you is choose your subject very carefully choose your specialization or your masters very carefully because that is going to decide the rest of your career and once you have decided the program choosing this school is quite easy if i want to study purchasing where would i study the number one program is being taught here if I want to study bachelor's in business administration, where should I study? It's being taught here. So I'm sure you would make a right decision for yourself. I'm sure you would choose sun over clouds. This is Sketch Business School Marseille campus, one of my favorite campuses when it comes to business schools globally. I studied here four years ago, worked in Paris for two and a half years, made my international career, went back to India, created my own company, and now I represent my own business school in India as well. So I don't know if it's a success journey or not for me, but it somehow matches with what I had, uh, what plans I had four or five years ago. And it correlates with all those goals which were probably not possible a few years ago. So I want to thank you once again. And I look forward to interacting with you.
and I look forward to welcoming you in this campus very soon. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye.